And employees of a voter registration group admit to Indiana State Police that they fabricated or forged the signatures of Indiana voters. According to our sister station, Wish TV in Indianapolis, staff with the Indiana Voter Registration Project told state police investigators that they were under pressure to register voters, and that led some to forge signatures or re-register people already signed up to vote to reach their quotas. However, an attorney for the Indiana Voter Registration Project says that's not true. There's not quotas, but as you can imagine, if somebody goes out and they don't have any applications, they're not doing their work. So you expect people to come back with some applications, but there are no quotas. This is a respectable organization. But court records show at least three employees said there was pressure to meet daily quotas of at least 10 registered voters. Another worker told police that her supervisor told her to do so, quote, by any means necessary. State police say they were tipped off by the Hendricks County clerk who says she noticed forms where signatures didn't match up. A spokesman for the Indiana Voter Registration Project's parent company, Patriot Majority USA, released a statement that said in part, most of the canvassers mentioned in these warrants were fired, let go, not called back or quit before the state police became involved in this matter. So far, no criminal charges have been filed in the case.